Hello guys, it's Rakim and welcome back to another post-match reaction, man. So today we're going to be talking about um, Venezuela versus Argentina, man, in the 2019 Copa America quarterfinal. This game ended in a 2-0 win for Argentina. Argentina are on to the semifinal to face Brazil, man, their arch rival, man. That's going to be a tough game. Might be going to penalty again, man. Brazil might win, Argentina might win, who knows, but that should be a very interesting game, man. And uh, yeah, Latora, man, Latora Martinez. Man after match, bro. Superb game by him. Uh, scoring um, a goal and hitting the post. Almost scoring two goals, man. Phenomenal game by him. He has been doing very well so far, man. And uh, Aguero, bro. You got to give credit to Aguero. Pretty much involved in both of those goals, man. And uh, he, Messi playing the, in the um, at, as the uh, attacking midfield role. Uh, probably that bit role, role suit him right now because Argentina is winning games right now. They, they're playing very good defensively. Their goalkeeper Armani, man, came out a few good saves. Their defense, this, this is the best I've ever seen Argentina play defensively, man. So they're playing as a, a t as a team right now. They're clicking right now. So that's very good. Uh, Fines, uh, what's his name? Fernandez, um, the goalkeeper for um, Valencia. I'm sorry, for Venezuela, man. He, he did all right, but um, his error led to the second goal, man. Didn't make a mistake that led to the second goal. So um they definitely got to improve man venezuela definitely got to improve and uh argentina they're doing right they're doing everything good right now and uh, uh pretty much turn things around man because that qatar game pretty much after that if they had lost to qatar man it would have been a whole different story man so they seem like they turn things around and they're playing good uh football again so hopefully they can continue this and um see my boy uh messi scoring his first um winning his first uh, international trophy man but pretty much too early to talk about that uh pretty much man this game um argentina pretty much dominated venezuela in all aspect man ball possession passing uh they pretty much live in all venezuela um half man they the chances created they created so many chances man so many opportunity and uh venezuela had one or few um opportunity brazil i mean argentina just kept them at bay bro they kept them at bay they kept them contained bro every time they was trying to make something happen they pretty much shut it off man defensively argentina was just like on a beast mode man they pretty much clogged them clogged the midfield they clogged their defense and every time they, um venezuela was trying to make something happen they intercept the ball they steal the ball and uh venezuela was pretty much looking um very def uh the de de deflated um not a lot of momentum, lot of confidence, man. So, uh, Morello was trying to make things happen, man. Rondon did not really get too many services up top, man. The only player that I really say did very well for Venezuela was probably uh, Pino in defense, man. Everybody else had, had a terrible game, man. They had a horrible game. Uh, man, it's a match. Definitely got to be uh, Martinez, man. Toro Martinez. And uh, never really know too much about this guy. I knew about him because he played for Inter Milan. But, like, really watch him playing right now, man. This guy is definitely... Um, very very talented man scoring that first goal that first goal was just crazy pretty much a crazy uh, back heel goal man it's just crazy man how he scored that that was a beautiful goal definitely one of the best goals of the tournament in my opinion Aguero as I said man involved in both of those goals uh, first goal came in a 10 minute man, early in the game and so Argentina pretty much um, established their dominance in the game early in, in the game and it pretty much um, dominate the game from the t from, from that point on man uh, scoring goals and uh, defending very well and Argent no matter what Venezuela did man they just couldn't break them down man Argentina was so stubborn in their defense they just couldn't get break down and uh, Venezuela bro they got seen they kept on conceding goals and can't score goals man so they're out of the tournament and uh, Argentina have a good history of beating um, Venezuela whenever, whenever it matters man because last time um, they beat uh, Venezuela um, very important game for Venezuela beat them what 3-1 I believe to advance to the World Cup man and this was another important game for um, Argentina and they had to beat Venezuela and they beat them 2-0 to advance to the semi-final versus Brazil that should be a very interesting game and uh, yeah Martinez man scored a goal opening goal in the 10 minute he was very very good bro he was all over the pitch bro he was involved in most of the, um, the attacking plays for um, Argentina taking a lot of shots man uh, good passing and he's just always there at the right time and so he was just probably the key figure same with Aguero Messi didn't play the best of game man but he did an alright game at one time he tried to level Messi like two players pretty much um, tackle Messi man it was just crazy they did like some type of NFL tackle on Messi man but Messi just got up and shake it off I'm like this guy is tough this guy is strong but yeah the first goal is in the 10 minute man Aguero pretty much trying to shoot that goal and it went in the direction of uh, Latoro 
Martinez and Martinez just pretty much did it. Pretty wow. Every time that happened, bro, did a crazy back heel and um, and scored a goal, man. Confused the goalkeeper, uh, Fernandez. And uh, in the four, in the seventy-four minute, man, uh, uh, Salsa came on, bro. Salsa came on, and pretty much within a few minutes of coming on, like six minutes of coming on, he were involved in the second goal, man. Aguero shooting that goal from uh, top of the eighteen. The goalkeeper uh, couldn't get a hold on to it, man. Try to try to push it away, and uh, Lo Celso was right there to tap it in, man. And uh, good second goal for Argentina. And Argentina never looked back after they scored that second goal. Good goal by them, man. Everybody played well. Even Di Maria came on off the bench. I think he played phenomenally well. Um, Di Bala came on, man. But it was a, it was very poor overall. I don't see Di Bala really starting. He came on in like the 85th minute, so he didn't really make. Uh, he didn't have enough time to uh, make an impact on the game, man. But uh, good win for Argentina, man. If they continue playing like this, they're definitely gonna go far and might be able to win the tournament. The Brazil tie should be a tough one, man. Probably that's gonna be the toughest team. They play in the in the tournament so far. Brazil been heavy, man. Sometimes they draw games, sometimes they win games. So you never know what you're gonna get from Brazil, man. Sometimes they turn up, score a lot of goals versus you. Sometimes they won't. And uh, that you know, I don't know, man. I don't know. It's gonna be a tough one, bro. I don't know how to predict that one, man. It's gonna be a tough game. I wouldn't be surprised if we go down the penalty shootout and Brazil win on penalty shootout. Cause Brazil have a better goalkeeper, in my opinion. Um, but yeah, man. It's not re I was very surprised by Foyd, man. One Foyd, the Tottenham um, center back, he was playing on the right side. He played very well on the right side. Otamendi, uh, glad to see Otamendi back in the squad. He's played very well in the in the central defense. Uh, Tagliafico, man, he was all right, uh, and uh, Acuna was all right too, man. But definitely got to step it up. Aguero was, as I said, man, it was very impactful throughout the game. Uh, uh, was very involved and vital in those two goals. Uh, Martinez man scoring an opening goal and uh, pretty much involved in all the attacking plays for Argentina and he hit the post right before, right after the first half second half started man so uh, very good game by um, Argentina man looking forward to see how they do in the future and uh, if Messi could um, be able to win his first international match man but Messi definitely had to step it up a little bit more uh, it's good to see Messi not doing everything by himself though man there's other players around Messi that's really stepping up and winning games for Argentina without Messi man so that's kind of good and uh, stat wise man this game as I said man one-sided um, stat wise yeah man it was Venezuela bro Venezuela had more ball possession man uh, and uh, as I said, man, Argentina defended very well and lot and stopped them from creating a lot of chances. But it did add more um, ball possession. With that, uh, they had like 60% ball possession, while Argentina um, they had like what 59 ball possession, while Argentina only had 1%. Argentina out shoot them though, man. 17 shots in total, while Venezuela had six shots in total. Argentina had uh, seven shots on target. Venezuela had only one shot on target, man. So looking forward to the semifinal, man. I want to see who's going to throw. Uh, definitely like, definitely subscribe, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, leave a comment, share this video, man. Let me know what team you support, man, uh, Venezuela, will Argentina beat Brazil? Let me know. With that, you boys out of here. Peace.